Uh, let's talk more about that scorching heat. It is also taking a toll uh, on especially vulnerable communities like seniors and people with chronic diseases and those who experience homelessness and poverty. Uh, and that is why the Salvation Army of North Texas is pitching in to offer some relief to those folks and anybody else who needs it. Joining us today, Christina Cavalier, the Senior Director of Community Relations with the Salvation Army of North Texas. Christina, thanks for, for being with us to talk about this. This is a very important thing uh, for people, especially who are at risk. Yeah, thank you for having me. Uh, so let's talk about the resources uh, that you all are able to offer people who are struggling with this kind of heat that we've been dealing with and the services that you all uh, are able to give them. Uh, what exactly can they find with you? Well, the Salvation Army offers a myriad of services for people who need help in this extreme heat. Um, one thing we do is we have 13 polling stations at our locations across five counties here in North Texas. And so it provides an opportunity for people to come in out of the heat, get a snack, some water, um, cool off in the AC. In addition to that, we provide bottled water and box fans through 12 food pantries across North Texas, thanks to our partners Reliant and Westlake Ace Hardware. Um, we also provide utility assistance for people that may be struggling to pay their electric bill during this time. Um, and we also take our emergency mobile feeding units out into high needs areas um, to provide services directly to those people who may be experiencing homelessness. Uh, some of this stuff, if, if, you know, if someone's sitting on their sofa right now and their AC is cranking along, Christina, and you know, they've got a, a nice tall you know, glass of iced tea sitting next to them, it's easy to not know how hard this is if you don't have all of those wonderful amenities. You know, just earlier this week, we were hearing about an elderly man uh, down in the Houston area who died uh, because of the heat. He had lost his job recently and just couldn't afford to get the AC fixed. We also have people who feel like they can't afford to run the AC even if it is working. Uh, so even something like a cooling station makes such a tremendous difference. How important do you tell people it is, you know, to every now and then maybe get off that sofa in their very comfortable home and check on their neighbors who might be struggling and might benefit tremendously from some of this stuff and, and, and you know, say, hey, there's some help at the Salvation Army. Yeah, these are really critical services. And to your point, a lot of people may not realize that, but there are more heat related deaths than any other type of weather related deaths. Um, so this is a big concern here in North Texas. And people can always come to the Salvation Army, find their nearest location at SalvationArmyNorthTexas.org or direct their neighbors or those that they see and need to come to us um, for assistance. And we are here to help for as long as we need to. Mm -hmm. uh, let's talk about what people at home can do uh, because we know that all of this stuff costs money. Uh, the, 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 the services that you all offer, what, what do you ask for from people you know, who aren't struggling right now w with this heat. Thank you. Yes, you're right. We do depend upon the support of the public to um, help those in need. So if people are interested in making contribution, they can do so on our website, SalvationArmyNorthTexas.org, and that is the best way um, to help us at this point. And I want to underscore, you know, something that you mentioned there a moment ago about help with utility bills, because again, some people forego and, and, you know, maybe the heat gets kind of dangerous inside their homes because they think that they can't afford it. There is help for that. Yes, we do provide utility assistance. And again, um, people can visit their local core community center and they can find those locations on our website and go in and get help from our staff there. All right, Christina Cavalier, Senior Director of Community Relations with the Salvation Army of North Texas. Thanks again for, for what you all do and for the helpful information this afternoon. Thank you. Thank you. And uh, folks, check on your neighbors too. They may be struggling and you don't even know it.